I am Yunisar Aharadi Sangkula, your facilitator for today. At the end of this lesson, a student will be able to identify the type of sequence. Number two, to be able to learn the basic pattern in mathematics. Number three, to be able to differentiate the type of sequence. And now, this could differ what is sequence is all about. Sequence is the arrangement of any objects or a set of number in a particular order followed by some room. Another definition for sequence is a multiplication that are composed by rule. A sequence is a permutation of any number or a set of rule that are followed in adding. Since sequence is followed by some rule, these are commonly used in mathematics and this list of sequence are the things that you are going to learn today. First is arithmetic sequence, geometric sequence, harmonic sequence, and the last one is Fibonacci sequence. What is arithmetic sequence? This sequence in which every term is created by multiplying or dividing a definite number to the preceding number is an arithmetic sequence. So the formula of arithmetic sequence is a sub n is equals to a sub 1 plus the quantity of n negative 1 times b, where a sub n is the n term, a sub 1 is the first term, and the d is the common difference. In order to get the point of what is arithmetic sequence, let's have an example. The example is, what is the 10th term and what is the common difference of 0, 4, 8, 12, 16, blank. So these are the 4 choices. A, 24, B, 28, C, 32, D, 36. In order to find out the correct answer, let's proceed by solving. So, let's utilize the formula of arithmetic sequence, where a sub 1 plus the quantity of n minus 1 times b. So, let's substitute of the formula. So, since the our first term is 0, automatically is plus times the quantity of uh, and so the our 10th term is a uh, 10 minus 1 times 4 is equals to 9 times 4 equals to 36. So the our only answer is letter D, which is uh, is equals to 36. Our next topic is geometric sequence. This is a sequence in which Every number is obtained by adding a definite number with the preceding number is known as geometric sequence. In order to learn more about the geometric sequence, let's have an example. Example is find the missing term in every geometric sequence uh, 1, 4, 16, 64, 64, blank, blank. So, there's, these are the choices. A, 256, 1024. B, 259, 1026. C, 15, 155. D, 1024, 2024. In order to get the correct answer, we must multiply the given term by 4. You are given 10 seconds to answer the question. Time start now. So 
So the our correct answer is letter E, which is 256 and 1024. Our next topic is harmonic sequence. It is a series of numbers that are used for harmonic sequence in adding any kind of objects. Let's explore the harmonic sequence by solving this example. Let's explore the harmonic sequence by solving this example. Our given 1 fourth, 1 sixth, 1 eighth, 1 ten, 1 twelve, and blank. What is the next number? These are the choices. A, 1 14, B, 1 13, C, 1 11, D, 1 15. You are given 10 seconds to answer the question. The our answer is letter A, which is 114. Our last topic for type of sequence is Fibonacci. It is a sequence used in pattern like arithmetic sequence. Let's try to solve it by using the our example of Fibonacci. What is the next term in the Fibonacci sequence of 0, 1, 1, 2, 3, 5, and 8, blank. The our choices is uh, A, 13, B, 14, C, 11, D, is 15. You have given up 10 seconds to answer the our question. So the our answer is letter E, which is 13. And now, it's your turn to answer this following question. What is the next number of 9, 4, negative 1, negative 6, negative 11, and negative 16? Time start now. The correct answer is negative 21. Complete the 8th term of this equation. The timer starts now. The correct answer is 1 over negative 44, 1 over negative 50, 1 over negative 56, and 1 over negative 62. Given the Fibonacci sequence 5, 8, 13, 21, 34. Find 6 term. Timer starts now. The correct answer is 55, 89, 144, 233, 377, and 610. Find the missing term in its geometric sequence. The timer starts now. The correct answer is 192 and 768. This is the end of our discussion. Hope that you have learned something in this session. Thank you very much. See you next time.